The question of whether 3ds Max or Blender is best depends on various factors and individual needs. Here are some points to consider. 1. User Interface and Workflow 3ds Max, known for its user-friendly interface, 3ds Max offers a customizable layout with dockable panels and a robust command system. Its workflow focuses on a traditional approach to 3D modeling and animation, making it easier for users transitioning from other software. Blender Blender's interface has a more unique layout, with a focus on hotkeys and a single window workflow. It offers a highly customizable interface, allowing users to create their own layouts. However, the initial learning curve may be steeper due to its unconventional design. 2. Modeling Tools and Techniques 3ds Max 3ds Max provides a wide range of modeling tools and techniques, including polygonal modeling, NURBS modeling, and parametric modeling using modifiers. It also offers advanced features like Pro Optimizer, Editable Poly, and the Graphite modeling tools for precise control over geometry. Blender Blender's modeling capabilities are extensive, offering polygonal modeling, NURBS, and sculpting tools. Its robust mesh editing tools, such as the powerful modifier stack, make it a versatile choice for modeling complex objects. Blender's sculpting tools, like dynamic topology and multi-resolution, are especially notable for organic modeling. 3. Animation and Rigging 3ds Max 3ds Max has a strong animation system with features like character animation, inverse kinematics, and procedural animation. It offers powerful rigging tools, including CAD and biped, allowing for efficient rigging and character animation workflows. Blender Blender excels in character animation and rigging, offering a flexible and advanced armature system. Its animation tools include keyframe animation, shape keys, and a comprehensive graph editor. Blender's rigging features, like the Rigify add-on and automatic IK setup, streamline the rigging process. 4. Rendering and Materials 3ds Max 3ds Max supports multiple rendering engines, such as V-Ray, Arnold, and Mental Ray, allowing users to achieve high-quality renders. It offers a node-based material editor with a vast library of pre-built materials and shading options. Additionally, 3ds Max provides access to advanced lighting and global illumination techniques. Blender Blender has its built-in rendering engines, Cycles and Eevee. Cycles is a powerful, physically-based ray tracing renderer, while Eevee is a real-time engine suitable for quick previews and animations. Blender's node-based material editor provides extensive control over material creation and procedural textures. 5. Integration and Industry Adoption 3ds Max Developed by Autodesk, 3ds Max is widely adopted in industries like architecture, film, and game development. It integrates seamlessly with other Autodesk products, such as Maya and AutoCAD, enabling efficient workflows and file exchange between software. Blender Blender's adoption has been steadily growing, and it is increasingly used in various industries. It has good compatibility with other software through formats like FBX and Alembic. Additionally, Blender's open-source nature promotes community-driven development and frequent updates. Remember that this is a general comparison, and the suitability of each software depends on individual needs, preferences, and the specific requirements of your projects. Both 3ds Max and Blender offer powerful capabilities, so choosing the right one ultimately comes down to personal preference, budget, and the specific industry or project requirements. Hey guys, this channel is almost to hit 400 subscribers, so, canister subscreen the channel. Thank you.